It is time now for Ask the Expert. It is back to school time, and for parents, that means more demanding schedules and less time. Yeah, so how can we squeeze in a quality workout? Well, we got the guy here to tell us all about that, Wellness Ambassador David Pritchard. And a quick story here, you got USA Basketball on. Yeah. Celebrating the moment. The Celebrating goal. the moment. That was a great game. I mean, they, they killed them. It was yeah. not even a game. Well, you were with the team in China. Yeah, I was in 08, and it was an unbelievable experience to be part of that gold medal team, training the players and all the basketball players. It was great in seeing this team win, and all the athletes that did such an amazing job. I'm in denial right now. Uh -huh. yeah. Such a part of my life for the last two weeks. And going back to that time, it was a time when we didn't have a lot of facilities for the guys when we got there. Yeah. So we had to find unique ways to fit in training in between two or three days of downtime. And so this workout really was inspired by the uh, NBA players. This is an Olympic okay? workout. This is yeah. an Olympic workout for you. There's and no that, excuses. I think that means like working parents are like Olympic That's athletes. That's right, <laughs> especially coming up with school. I mean, yeah. their schedules are getting more complex. Mm -hmm. So what starts to happen is they become lower and lower on the list. Right. You know, everything else. And so it's easy just to say, no, I don't, right. I'm not gonna do don't it. Have time. So this workout will give you no excuses because you don't need much weight. You only need a dumbbell. You don't need very little equipment. You can right. do it right in your living room before the kids even go to school. So the premise of these four movements is that it works the entire body. All right. okay. okay, so you're getting your heart rate up. You're gonna so do them. We're gonna watch. I'm going to yeah. do them. You get to watch. You get to watch. We'll so do the, some Olympic cheering. <laughs> so 10 to 12 repetitions. I want you to feel fatigued at each rep. Sure. So we're going to start, of course, really quick, moms and dads. It's push-up. You make <sighs> them look so easy. Of course, we can fatigued. modify it, get onto the knees. Yep and go up and down. So okay. 10 to 15 reps. If you don't feel challenged at yep. 15, do 20. Okay. You know, I want you to feel that challenge and that burn because that's where the results are. It's only going to take 10 minutes to get results. Right. Right. So next, we're going to pick up the dumbbell and we're going to go into a full body squat, curl, shoulder press. Okay, so now I'm getting my legs, mm -hmm. I'm getting my biceps, and I'm getting my shoulders. I'm keeping my core nice and tight. Right. I'm breathing out. The back on the straight. way up, my right. back is nice and straight, Charles. Yep. So you're getting a lot of bang for your time. Mm -hmm. So again, it's one of those things. You have time to do this movement. If this is the only movement you do out of the four, you're going to get some results. But we're only halfway through the workout. Okay. Now. <laughs> and we have 30 seconds I can barely left. Contain quick, myself. quick. Back rows. We got to take care of that back. Right. Okay. You know, parents have a lot on their shoulders, so let's get your back nice and strong. Right. Okay. One arm row, nice and easy. Doesn't need to be a lot and of again, weight. Keep that core tight. Right. Yeah, yeah, you're in a nice straight line, keeping that core. Tight. How do you know how much weight to use? You want to feel fatigued at 12, yep. 15 reps. If you're not, it's too light. Right. Okay. Okay. Now we're gonna finish with planks. Okay. Oh, but I'm gonna add a favorite, little. My favorite. <laughs> I'm gonna add a little variation to this plank, so All it's right. just not you standing still. Right. We're gonna be here, yep. and we're gonna move the hips to the side. Oh, wow. Move the hips to the side. Uh -huh. So we're getting in some more trunk stability, and you're going side to side, 20 repetitions. Back and forth. Brittany behind Look. the camera wants to do that. She's looking at that. <laughs> she, I can do doesn't that. Doesn't she look pumped? <laughs> yeah. But again, these workouts are for and they're designed for people who don't have a lot of time. All right. And you only need to do it three or four days a week. Always good stuff. He's got yeah. the best. He's I'm going to do these tomorrow. If you have a question for our experts, email them at asktheexpert at todaystmj4.com. You can always leave a voicemail and we have the number right there for you.